Hello and welcome to Morley Antique Centre. Yeah, I, I just thought I might uh, take you around the antique centre that's just literally on the end of my road. Uh, I don't go in as much as I should do and I, I will be going in more often now. Because I've got a cabinet in there. Uh, I've put some of my stuff in there, which I will show you at the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. So I'm just going to have a quick look around. There's um, there's, there's there's a bit of a bit of um, vintage toys, a few vintage toys in there. Not not a lot, but there's just some some really interesting items in there, and uh, it's well worth c keeping your eye open for certain items in there. Um, I wanted to film upstairs as well. It's got there's a toy dealer on the top floor, but um, it wasn't there. <laughs> it was ideally it wasn't there. When I was wanted to film him, it was there the day before, but it wasn't there the day I was filming. Some nice bears there; those are really nice bears. So I will do an add-on. That boat, that boat is fantastic. It looks like if you put an Indiana Jones on it, that'd be perfect. Ninety-five pound for that is brilliant. So yeah, I'll be doing not daily blogs, but maybe weekly blogs. Just to show you what I've got in my cabinet and what I found in this hidden away antique centre. I don't want it to be underway, hidden away for very much longer because I want to sell some of my stuff. <laughs> some nice annuals there. I believe Blue Peter and the Eagle annuals. Annuals seem to have um, risen in value recently. So there's plenty of cabinets uh, from dis different dealers, obviously. Uh, I do have just one single cabinet for now. Uh, I might be upgrading to a double cabinet. And even one of these booths. One of these booths is £100 a month. But I'm paying £40 a month for uh, the cabinets. The booth's not bad. I'm sure I could fill one of those with the stuff I've got. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. And... Um, Hopefully, because that, that York picture is fantastic. Hopefully we can uh, move on to bigger and better things. Not so sure about that sword. <laughs> um, you can see it's not very busy at the moment. It's, it does get busy. I mean, last week I went in last week and uh, it, was, it was packed in there. So it just depends what day it is. Obviously Saturdays... There is auctions through the other door, so it will get pretty busy around then. They've just had one this past weekend, so um, some dinky in there, some dinky and spot on. Very often, not very often you see spot on cars. I'm very tempted by those. And I think the, I think there's one missing. There was one in there the other day that I'm really interested in. I, I don't know if somebody's. Uh, Tried to buy it because it was it's supposed to be for, for a job lot. Not Teddy's five pound. <laughs> so yeah, through there is the auctions. So it's a right there's a right mix of stuff in there. What's that a uh, cabbage patch still? <laughs> that is that's a beautiful picture. really nice stuff in there and I say with it being out of the way it kind of goes un under the radar which I uh, hope as I said hopefully not for much longer dinosaurs in there they've been there for a while I think <laughs> but uh, if you like your dinosaurs that's a place to go template toys that's all the stuff that's been in the auction so these will be cabinets uh, spoilers there's there's mine go past it pretty quickly <laughs> spoilers there we go you can have a quick look we look at it at the end you can have a, a good look at it at the end but keep watching I 
Uh, sorry if my voice sounds a bit uh, a bit bad. I've I've fallen cold. So yeah, these. Uh, if you're interested, if you're in the area, you're interested. There are cabinets still available as well. I think I will upgrade to one of these. Uh, one of these bulls, if it goes well. Vinyls, which I, I didn't go through, but um, plenty of time. I will have to pop in every couple of days, I think, just to see what's going on. And replace things if I have to. Because, I'll be honest with you, that's a nice double uh, Lotus. I don't think it works, so I think I've seen that one before and it doesn't work. Uh, yeah, I just... I have too much stuff in my little cabinet. Oh, there's Blackpool. Something for Wayne. <laughs> there you go, Wayne. So yeah, um, I do have too much stuff for my cabinet. Uh, I do have stuff left here. I need to take down as well, and um, if and if and when I sell sell some stuff, I will um, replace it with the stuff I've got here. Nice desk, nice school desk in there, and if you can read those, that was at you. You have wooden desks. You remember them? I can. So there you go. There was a very nice lady. They did have a booth. Uh, I was chatting there. She is. Um, she did have some nice corgi. Yeah, buses and trams. That cabinet's really nice. Uh, I'll show. I'll show you those. Uh, those buses in a bit. Here we go. And that's that's a. Uh, if you're interested in these or anything. They're just brilliant. I just, they, I, like I, I said to her, they're not really my wheelhouse. They're not really my interest. But I can, I can um, appreciate the value one. They are fantastic. Look at that tram. There's, there's a, a London tram. There's a a Sheffield bus. There's a double that double decker bus is fantastic. I think she's. I don't know if she's putting them in the auction. I think she, these are worth quite a bit of money, so I think they are going to go in the auction. But if she puts them up, I'm going to be interested because some of those are really nice. Yeah, there's a 49ers picture, which is ten pound, which is pretty good. But they do have. Oh, Playmobil. They do have a uh, a Dolphins one and a Broncos one. And the only reason I haven't got the Dolphins one yet is because I've got nowhere to put it. This booth did have a Corgi Saint remote control Saint car last week, and it sold. It was it was it was twenty pound, but I thought. I was going to come back for it and uh, it's gone, unfortunately. It was down there. Uh, that's me looking for it. <laughs> it's gone. Damn. Yeah, it was down there. Yeah, it's not there. It's not there. Stop looking. <laughs> so there's the dolphins picture. I'm going to show you in a minute. There we go. I would like. I'm. I, I will. I will try and buy it. I don't want to buy that. Uh, and the Broncos one. There's a Jets one as well, but we won't mention that one. I think it's um, the about 83, 84 those those posters. So this is my cabinet. Come and come and buy a, buy everything, please. <laughs> Thank you. 
I have actually taken everything off uh, eBay. All, all these, all these in, this, in the cabinet, I've taken off eBay now, and I'm just going to sell them as they are. Still have a few bits on eBay, but uh, I'm not going to. I'm not going to put them at this both places. Because if if I if I sell something on eBay, then it sells in the cabinet. I don't. I wouldn't know. So yeah. So there we go. So please visit, if you're in the area, Morley Antique Centre. Very nice place, very nice people.